James again on the quest for uh, big audio and uh, welcome to my truck. So, uh, I don't know, I, standard kind of truck stereo. Uh, I have my iPod here. Love to listen to my iPod in my truck. So I use one of these, uh, no auxiliary input. So I use one of these fancy little tape things to be able to listen. So uh, plug it into the tape deck, tape comes on plug that into my iPod, turn my iPod volume way up, press play, the pendulum. need to uh, turn volume way up in my truck and have volume way up on here. So this is another case where I'm going to end up using the G-Rod and uh, so what I'm going to end up doing is I'll uh, unplug from there. I'll turn my iPod volume way down and I'll turn my truck volume way down. Plug in my uh, little USB power charger, which is not included with the G-Rod. And uh, we'll plug the G-Rod into that to be able to power it up. We will take from audio out We'll take the line going to the tape deck that plugs into the audio out. From the audio in, we will uh, plug that into the iPod again. Again, I've turned the volume way down on my iPod. Volume's way down on the car stereo. And press play. too loud but now you're not too loud is good <laughs> So the beautiful thing about this in my truck is I don't have to have the iPod cranked, the truck stereo cranked, and I get all that kind of crackly noise that ends up coming with it. With the G-Rod, it enables me to plug it in. It actually all tucks away really quite nicely as I'm going down the road. And yeah, I can have big sound when I want it, or uh, I can have it nice and quiet. 